Hi, this is Hilary Stupa with Qdabra Software, and today I'm going to demonstrate for you how to use the new Qdabra form services and form modus to save mobile form data and attachments to a SharePoint list. So here's a copy of the expense report that I'm using that I've opened up on my iPad, and I've already filled some information out. I still need to add some images for my receipts. You can see I've added my expenses below. So I'll go ahead and use the picture control in my form that is provided by Formotus for use with their app. And I will take some photos of my receipts so that I can submit those along with my expense items. Just select the camera icon. Focus in on my receipt here take a picture of it, select use photo, and now I'll do the same for my second receipt. I'll go ahead and just click on the camera icon and get dialed in here on my receipt and I'll take a picture of it. Any accountants out there are going to notice that this date's a little, a little off. <laughs> and there is my second receipt. So now I have both receipts attached here to my form along with my expenses. I've got a button on the bottom of my form that's going to submit these items to a SharePoint list using the new QDevra Form Services web service. So I'll click Submit List Items and go ahead and confirm that dialog that pops up and this will submit to my list. We can see by the pop-up dialog that um, my submit succeeded. I can go ahead and dismiss that. And here is my Office 365 site that shows my two new items that I just submitted. And we can go and we can take a look at those receipts here. We can just open up each item. Click on the attachment. We'll get a warning dialog. We'll say OK to that. And here is the photo that we just took, submitted along with our list item. Taking a quick look at the form in design mode, we can take a look at the rules that are on the submit list item button. And we're simply submitting using a data connection. If we take a look at this data connection, the QFS submit data connection is using our submit to SharePoint list operation. And that operation takes two parameters. Uh, one is the entire main data source of the form, and the other is a parameter of the library that contains the published form template that has a mapping file that we will use to map our data to our list. This mapping file can be created using the QRules tool that we use for creating SharePoint list mappings. The only requirement here is that it be in the resource files and that it have a name of mapping XML. So as long as you've got a mapping XML in here, uh, your QFS data service connection can submit these items to your SharePoint list. So that's all there is to it. Simply add your data connection, make sure you have a mapping file, and you can submit data to your Office 365 SharePoint list from a mobile form in Formotus using our new Azure-based QFS web service. Here's some additional information on us. I hope you enjoyed this demo. Have a great day.